Key market indexes were back near session highs Friday afternoon, as the Dow Jones Industrial Average swung from a 180-point loss to a 100-point gain. Make sure to stick to the end, because we will go through today's hottest stocks and market moves. Let's start with a quick market overview. The Nasdaq rose 1.2%, the S&P 500 advanced 0.6%, while the Dow Jones Industrials was up 0.4% in the stock market today. Small caps tracked by the Russell 2000 rose 0.8%. Volume was lower on both major exchanges versus the same time on Thursday. For the week, the Nasdaq is nearly unchanged, while the S&P 500 is headed for a 1.7% dip and the Dow a 2.7% slip, as the latter two join the Nasdaq below their 10-week moving average lines. The Russell 2000 is on track for a 6% weekly drop. The stock market had reached new highs following the virus crash. But the market outlook was lowered to market and correction on Wednesday, as the major indexes suffered sharp declines. The Nasdaq holds a 19% year-to-date gain despite recent volatility, while the S&P 500 was flat through Thursday's close. The Dow is down 6%, and the Russell 2000 is now 13% underwater this year. Read the big picture for detailed market analysis. Apple, Microsoft led Dow. Boeing, Apple and United Health were the Dow's biggest winners. Apple rose 2% to extend Thursday's upside reversal. Shares remain stuck below their 50-day line, but are more than 50% extended from a 72.15 by point of a cup with handle. Microsoft tacked on 1%, also adding to its Thursday gains. It's also trying to get back above its 50-day line. The software giant has traded below the 50-day since September 8. Shares are 14% extended from a 180.10 by point of a cup with handle cleared in May. But Goldman Sachs fell 1.5% in above-average volume after leading the Dow on Thursday with a 5% jump. Shares are 23% off their 52-week high. Automakers, solar and software stocks led the upside among the market's industry groups. But banks, home builders and oil and gas stocks lagged. Tesla races ahead. Electric car maker Tesla rallied 5% in fast turnover, adding to Thursday's 2% upside reversal. Shares are again rebounding off the 50-day line. The leaderboard stock is on track for an 8% drop this week, but is still 13% extended from a 359.10 entry. The Innovator IBD50 ETF climbed 0.7%, thanks to rising software and healthcare names. Cyplay, best known for its free-to-play mobile casino games, rose more than 2%. Viva Systems and Workday also climbed more than 2%. Horizon Therapeutics, Bristol-Myers Squibb and Emergent Biosolutions added over 1% each. Virus Update. Worldwide virus cases have topped 32.5 million, with more than 989,000 deaths, according to Worldometer. In the US, confirmed cases are approaching 7.2 million, with the death toll near 208,000. As the race toward a virus treatment or vaccine heats up, Johnson & Johnson climbed 0.4%. The healthcare giant, which started phase 3 trials for its vaccine candidate earlier this week, signed a contract manufacturing deal for its vaccine. The Dow stock is trying to hold support at its 200-day moving average. J&J is about 4% below a 151.77 by point of a cup with handle cleared last month, according to MarketSmith chart analysis. Thank you all for watching. Consider to subscribe and leave a like if you enjoyed today's video.